good night's sleep so far and here we are back on the road again this morning I'm gonna try and make it down to uh, around the Cleveland Ohio area for tonight I believe so we'll be going through Chicago and uh, yeah, so uh, probably go either to South Beloit or uh, Rochelle again to fuel up today and uh, I'll see how check out the prices later on to see what the fuel is at uh, Rochelle if it's a lot cheaper again then I will go there again because uh, the last couple of months it seems like at uh, Rochelle the, uh, the fuel seems to be 15 cents a gallon cheaper than in South Beloit and it's only like 15 miles further for me to go around uh, that area so definitely pays for itself you know Anyways, we'll get it rolling and uh, see what happens today. Just take a look at this. I am at the truck wash. I haven't done that all summer. Alrighty, just finished washing the truck over here. The sun is really bright, so I can't really look into it. But just have a take a look. Looks pretty good. It looks like they did a did an awesome job on it. The trailer certainly doesn't look as clean as the tractor, but uh, definitely looks good. They did a good job. Thank you guys. All right, just left the Portage uh, Petro here, Portage, Wisconsin, and uh, had my truck washed over there by those guys there at the Petro. And I've got it done there before, but I haven't done it all summer long uh, because I I have my own pressure washer at home. In summer, I uh, I wash the truck at home normally, and uh, it's starting to get towards the fall already, so it's a little starting to get a little on the cool side at home, but. Uh, I would have washed the truck at home had it not been for our daughter being in the hospital so I didn't have no time to do that at home so now since I got on the road uh, the truck was really dirty so I figured I'd get the truck wash you know and uh, they do an awesome job up there so uh, definitely recommend anybody uh, especially from uh, Manitoba that goes this area a lot definitely uh, go get their truck washed over there they, they do an awesome job over there I, I like going there it's them and then uh, stay mart there and uh, cargo that's about the places I normally would go but uh, anyways it's a nice beautiful uh, sunshine day up here today so uh, yeah get going and see what happens alrighty I left uh, Rochelle Illinois a little bit ago Fueled up over there and got me a bite to eat up there. Now we're uh, going towards Chicago. I'm gonna try and make it as far as I can tonight, but uh, I don't know. Hopefully, the traffic won't be too bad here in Chicago today. Because it's like 2 uh, 2.30 in the afternoon over here, so. Oh well, but uh, yeah. I don't know. My uh, wife texted me uh, saying that the uh, doctors had told her to uh, that they were uh, going to have to put the draining tube back in. That's not uh, not really good for us or for my daughter, you know. It was a little difficult for me, but uh, hopefully she'll be better soon. Alrighty, I just uh, finished my day up here. I am uh, stopped at a uh, rest area right now. And uh, yeah, so uh, I'm going to be spending the night over here. Tomorrow I should be able to... Uh, make it down to my delivery place I have called them and arranged to be there for three o'clock I know it's a little tight for me but uh, I should be able to do it as long as I don't run into any kind of problems uh, it shouldn't be any problems making it down there so it's about a seven hour drive and I got about eight hours that I can do it in so I should be all right but uh, anyways uh, today has been a bit of a hard day for me since my daughter uh, ended up back in the ICU room today 
which uh, is kind of disappointing but uh, nothing I can do about it I guess but uh, just uh, makes it hard for me being out here on the road and not being able to be there and because I do have to be able to make money and support the family too you know uh, but anyways uh, it should do it for today I'll probably uh, cut this off here and uh, we'll see you again tomorrow at 5 a.m. so thanks for watching don't forget to hit that subscribe button mm -hmm.